The UN Climate Conference starts in just a little more than a week in Paris, France. Hungarian President Janos Eder is also to attend. He said in a radio interview on Sunday that there is reason for optimism. An agreement is quite possible that could be a great result in fighting global climate change. There's a chance for an agreement at the Paris UN Climate Conference, said Janos Ader in an interview on public radio on Sunday. The Hungarian president added 156 countries have submitted their national climate plans, promising to reduce their pollutant emissions. Among them were countries previously opposing the initiative. The head of state called these facts encouraging. For the first time this spring, the President of the United States called the climate change the most important challenge of national security. The Central Committee of the Communist Party of China did the same two weeks later. These are the two most pollutive countries, the United States and China, he said. Extreme weather, significantly more floods, droughts, natural and humanitarian disasters. These could be the consequences if we don't prevent the adverse effects of climate change, said Janusz Ader. Wars would break out between neighboring countries for the ever-reducing freshwater reserves. And if people don't have a land and irrigating water that can give them good quality crops, then they will start moving somewhere else. That migration would be significant, he said. The UN will have its 21st climate change conference in Paris and France between the 30th of November and the 11th of December. The goal of the summit, where the heads of 195 countries will gather, is to come to an agreement to limit global warming to less than 2 degrees Celsius. This could help slowing down climate change. Janusz Ader launched a petition in May. The people who gave their electronic signature on elubojgong.hu website could help putting pressure on the politicians attending the climate conference. Hungary was the first country to join this international initiative by Al Gore for